just a quick one tonight. Yo guys, welcome back to 621, uh, hashtag slash bandit supply co. So, tonight, what we're doing, just a quick one. Basically, uh, the BMW is currently on the green rims. Now, I don't know why I bought these, I'm not gonna lie. Um, they, I guess they look kinda cool to me. Um, should I pull the car out and show you it around real quick? Yeah, I, I tell you what, I'll show you what else we're doing to it. Uh, actually, no I won't. I will pull it out real quick. Where the fuck is the dog? Finn! Oh, you're there. What are you doing? I'm doing the keys, really. So the other day, I digged around on Facebook Live for a bit and we just fitted some wheels and all that sort of stupid stuff. Because, uh, you know, wheel fitting videos aren't exactly that exciting, so I thought I'd just do it on Facebook Live. Uh, let me turn the car off, it's noisy and rattly, isn't it? Hang on. So, we put these green 18 inch BMW wheels. I don't know what ones they are, but they're pretty cool, I think. Um, I sprayed them green in a rim job, ep rim job episode that I'll put um, up here on the screen right now if you want to go see it. So, that's what it looks like now on 18s, and I thought that looks pretty sick. But then I thought, actually, we're not allowed to run uh, spaces on the rear, see what wheels we could put on. And now that brings us to the next point in this story. Some of you guys may understand that I run 621. I also own a company called Whistle Wheels Europe. Now we bring in Whistle Wheels. They're like a low cost, cool looking cast wheel. They're not really, really nice wheels at uh, not a huge amount of money. And I just thought it'd be kind of, I run them on my, my um, legend and I thought it'd be cool to have some on this. Now, earlier I was doing a stock check and I found we've got loads in German car sizes and I thought, well, maybe we're not selling much because I never really do much promo in the German car world. And I'm not, you know, obviously that much of a German car enthusiast or pretend to be either. I like my BMW because it skids and it's cheap. So I thought, let's try and fit some of the whistlers on this. Now, they're quite big sizes, so I'll get the car back in Actually, I'm going to carry the wheels over now. Mm, I'm going to put the wheels in now and I'll show you them inside and then we'll get the car in. Not only do we need to try the whistlers on and just see if they're actually going to fit, but then we need to just put the old skid wheels back on so it's ready for next Wednesday because I'm back at Santa Pod again. So. I'm really excited. I absolutely am loving the uh, the drifting, if you couldn't tell. And uh, yeah, I just thought it'd be cool to kind of chuck a set of these wheels on. And why is the steering wheel not straight? For fuck's sake, you're such a retard, Adam. <sighs> what I have is 18 by 8.5 and, and 18 by 9.5 KR1s in chrome. There we go. So, I'm going to plug it for a bit, obviously, because this is my business and this is how I earn money. But uh, we obviously are Whistle Wheels Europe. We supply uh, the Whistle Wheels. Um, I'll chuck a link down below if you're interested and I'll see what sort of percentage we can give the viewers off because obviously I want to help you guys out if you are a supporter of ours and you want some, some wheels of us. So, oi, don't you fucking dare. Finn, Finn, <whistles> Cuban. Don't. He loves chasing after horses, man. It's frustrating as hell. So I've only got two with me, I've got the other two in the car, because if these fit quite nice, which I think they're going to, I think they're going to fit real nice on the car, it means I'm going to have to try and take them to Will before next week to put some tyres on so we can get... So I can get some tyres put on them before the next drift day so I can do a couple of laps on them and hopefully get some nice photos for promo material. So yeah, sick. So they're kind of a little behind the scenes of running a business, I guess. So yeah, so I'm gonna chuck these on now, give myself plenty of space to work. Cool, so let's do it. All right, so back wheels off. Gonna take these crappy spaces off. They were, I really only put them on there to take photos of those wheels because the offset's fucking whack. So gonna chuck the nine halves on and just see how they fit. I think you can lower cars onto pieces of wood and I've got that bit of wood, so let's just, I've got that bit of wood there. So let's just, 
bit nerve wracking, but we'll see. I might uh, actually see if I can find another bit. But uh, anyway, let's, uh, let's crack on and get it on. Let's actually open one of these boxes, considering people seem to love box opening. Need a blade, need a blade. Sure what I will do. Alright, so you open the box like so. Then you get your rim. Drop. Hit. It's in packaging, obviously. Obviously. <laughs> yeah, it's in my packaging. So they're not directional wheels. Fuck it, let's just put it up here. And then in the box as well, you get your wheel cap. I'll show you. How shiny these chrome rims are. Yeah, they are chrome, boy. Yes, There we go. So, uh, over there. So, look at that. That is some shine, man. Like, for the price we sell these for, that I think they're rad. So, uh, and there's a nice dish on there as well, look, boys. Could be cool for a skid whip. Try and chuck this on and just see how it fits. I kind of want you guys to see this too. So let's put you somewhere that you can see. Oh. Boys, girls, I think it may be good. Look at that. They fit fucking sick. Whoa, that looks fucking bad boy, man. Yo, that's gonna look gangsta. So cool. Oh man, look at that. I'm gonna do the front as well. Oh dear me. Oh no, it's on the whole way. Cool. If I can find two more bits of wood, I'm gonna do the front at the same time. I think I could should be able to do that. <laughs> um, oh, that looks wicked. Oh, I'm stoked. Right, there we have it guys and girls. So these are the 18s by nine and a half and eight and a half. I think they look amazing and they clear the shocks and they're not gonna stick out too much either. So I think they're pretty fucking sick to be completely honest. Um, fully, fully buzzing on that. I think it looks sick. I'm definitely gonna go get the tires changed over. It'd be cool to be able to show you them but someone's uh, craving attention. As per always, that looks fucking rad. I'm stoked. Yo, <laughs> rad. Right, so it's decided. I think they look sick. They fit real, real nice. See if I can show you down there. The look at that. I think that looks so cool. I mean, I know it's a bit rusty and stuff, but this is my skid car, so whatever. Oh, get out of there! Stop being a dick. So yeah, like, just so stoked that we've got another car that I can advertise the product on. Obviously, that's. Something I'm always conscious of. It is how I how I earn my money. It is what we do. You know, we need to start selling more of these whistle wheels. We need to start moving more stock. I think with them being on here, hopefully it'll make other people see how cool they look and how affordable they really are. So I'm now going to put the BMW wheels back. Finn, fuck's sake, bro! Is there anything in there? No. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm now going to chuck the actual skid wheels on that I already got tires on. Then I've got to work out how and when I'm going to be able to get the 18s to wheel because we've got, like, we're doing some stuff tomorrow. So I think we'll, we'll be filming tomorrow anyway, so it should be kind of cool. Right, dudes, that's kind of over tonight. The car's back on the uh, Style 66 wheels, which, I'm not going to lie, I still love these wheels. I love their concave and that. They look sick. But I really wanted to just, I don't know, chuck a set of whistles on. We've got them in stock. I wanted to be able to explain to you guys again that we still sell them. And, um, yeah. I, I think they looked amazing. I hope they look as good on the car with tyres and stuff as they did now. I need to hopefully tomorrow get the tyres put on. All the green wheels are off, but they won't all fit in the car with the dog in, so I'll have to work something out tomorrow if we can get to the garage with Will to get them all changed. Fingers crossed. Also, I've seen there's a massive chunk out of one of my tyres on the front, but it's still holding air, so I'm just going to kind of roll with it. I've got spare spares as well. I've got good ones that just turned up. I've got Bridgestone RE 50As or 5 whatever they are. They're pretty good, I think. So I've got those for my other gold wheels. So I'll chuck those on um, tomorrow as well if I get the chance. I wonder if I'll be able to fit all these wheels in the car. I mean, worst case, I can get done at Drift Day. So it's all, it's all good. Drift car life. So yeah. I really hope you guys enjoyed this little tiny instalment. Remember, whistlewheels.co.uk or um, 621.com for whistle wheels. We'll um, chuck some form of deal on a few of the wheels, whatever. Hopefully you guys will grab them. If not, anyway, I hope you enjoyed. See you next time. Peace.